Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. In this video we are going to see a Minwell power supply uh, for a DIN rail. It has a big range of voltages and uh, different uh, watts. This is one, I think it is the smallest one. And as you can see model number is HDR das 15 das 24 that it is the volt uh, here let's take a look at the data sheet for the series and very simple din rail compatible clip back here uh, main input is here and output on the top as I have already seen the box down here you can see minimum 5 millimeters left and right and 40 millimeters above 20 below for a circulation so you can see here there is some kind of coil or uh, transformer so those vents are used for the heat dissipation of this power supply um, I'm, I will use this one on an automation panel uh, I will construct and I want to take a look inside and see what's the quality of this power supply and what you get this costs about uh, 15 18 uh, euro output of this one is 15 watts point 63 amps I don't know if you can see that so let's take it apart and take a look of uh, its construction inside and the quality also um, of this power supply so okay Put it here, here as well, and do we need so this was on the bottom one? And as we can already see, there is a vertical PCB design there. Oh, that looks very neat and tidy. Wow. So, what we saw, this is probably a choke coil for the input, uh, an EMF filter. Now, let's take a look. So here is on the vertical board is our input uh, terminal connector. Uh, there is an X2 capacitor. Okay, so input is input goes here there is some kind of um, fuse there it also looks broken hmm. and just goes straight down with two pins here on the board to the X2 capacitor 
then we have a metal oxide varistor I think there what looks like a, a resistor and it goes through the choke to the bridge rectifier just right here it looks really like a good design uh, as you can see it has a 27 uh, microfarad mains capacitor I am really curious what brand this may be and it is a Lelon RGA these uh, are not top ones but uh, you find them in many many um, computer power supplies from known manufacturers uh, and I am pretty sure it is a 2000 hour uh, joby we will take a look at the data sheet now as you can see here it gets a bit more complicated and that should be the power I see with some components on the bottom side as well here is our isolation um, optocoupler there the um, probably the main IC power capacitor this is J8 mm. I will need the magnifier for that I don't know if you can see that J8 there so I will have to check about that brand um, class Y capacitor here and you can see the Minwell logo on top of the transformer there now on the output we can see there is a Rubicon cap that's nice with the K on the vent uh, power, power diode here obviously and some more components small coil there for the indu inductor for the output and can we see this capacitor here it's on the very output uh, next to the terminal connector no I cannot make it is underneath now about this one for the money it does look uh, quite good quality I need to check this part here um, it has all the EMF things on the input side 
protection wise we rely on the transformer and this gap over here again for the money it looks good and uh, I'm going to trust this to be online 24-7 in an automation panel now ah, also there is an adjustment here so I don't remember we should check the no no it shows it here so we can adjust from 21.6 to 29 volts there you go so that is a very very uh, compact and small power supply it's the size of one uh, fuse or uh, breaker uh, I will trust this in my board thank you all for watching I hope you enjoy the video and see you on the next one bye